Well, hello, Virgo. Welcome to Sin of the Moon Goddess channel. We're doing a reading today for September the 13th through the 19th. I want to say welcome to Sin of the Moon Goddess channel. If you've been here before, I want to say thank you and welcome back. And if you've never been here before, I want to say welcome and thank you for coming and thank you for the love. And we thank you for giving us a chance to read you today. Whoa. So we do a 10 card Celtic cross here. Today I'm using the sun and the moon tarot cards. <clears throat> They're a little different, but they do not have reverse. So I'm going to let you know that first. And when we do our 10 cards Celtic cross, sometimes spirit gives us more than 10. Sometimes they give us 10. We do the 10 cards and then we clarify. Okay. Here we go. We need one more. Please, Spirit. Just, mm. I said, again, I said one more. They said more than one. Okay. All right. Abundance. Abundance of love and money. Abundance. That's what's coming to you, Virgo. I feel it. I feel it. Before we get started here, I want to ask you, please, if you haven't, please subscribe. There is a purple and white button right there on your right. Just click it. If you click that button, it'll say subscribe. And I thank you very much. That way you help me out. And not only would you help me out, it helps you out. Because when I get ready to do Virgo, it will uh, alert you that I'm uploading Virgo. And also when I do my live this week. Oh my God, I'm so excited and not excited. <laughs> Never done one before, so okay. So, let's get it. Let's go, Virgo. Oh, by the way, I am a Virgo. All right. So, our first card is where we are now. And we're in love. Y'all in love. Y'all in love. Y'all Virgos in love. <laughs> okay. Our focus for the week. Ah, a victory, baby. Uh -huh. This is our challenge for the week. If this is a challenge, I'll take it every week. A victory. And our focus is the fool's card. That means we're either starting new or we're taking a leap of faith. We're trying something we never tried before. Okay. Our recent past oh, is the two of cups, baby. We done found ourselves a love. Look, where we are now, our recent past. Look at there, look at there. Take that leap of faith. Victory, baby. Virgo, what's going on? Okay, strength. The eight of pentacles. You're being fruitful. You're helping people. You're working hard, too. Okay? You're working hard. Yes. This is your strength, your work ethics. Your strength is your work ethics. Okay? Your future is the Eight of Pentacles. It's coming at you, baby. Everything. Not just one thing. Several things. I see everything coming at you. Money. Uh, with, uh, money. Food, I hear. <laughs> money. Love. Everything that you've been manifesting is going to come at you this week. If it's not this week, it's going to be soon. Very soon. What you should know about the week. You're worrying. What are you worrying about? Hamburger. Huh, what you should get out of this week. Mm, now you're disappointed. But you got five fives here, two fives here, 55. That means major changes in your life. Major changes. Hmm. And it also can mean your twin flame is near. Okay. Mm. Hope and fears, the star card. Twin flame must be near. Because this is a happy card. It's going to make you happy. It's going to help you balance. 
Okay. Mm. The marriage card, passion, and money. All right. We gonna clarify, of course, but first let's go by the signs that I see. I see you, Virgo. You're definitely here. I see Scorpio is here. I see Cancer is here. Yes. Taurus is definitely here. Taurus is here twice. Okay. And like I said, some water is here, but I, I hear Scorpio. Aquarius is here is also. Okay. All right, let's go. Let's get it. Victory. And by the way, Virgo, you were in Taurus reading too. So if you're dealing with a Taurus, you might want to watch that one. Okay. Victory, baby. Victory. I love this card. The Six of Wands. Can you tell me what's the. Yeah. You're, the person that you're in love with don't stay close to you it, they even can be an ocean away but they, they're they not close but you're in love with them anyway yeah they've been spying on you but they recently stopped they want to help you uh, build your nest egg that's what I'm hearing in other words your money if you don't know what a nest egg is yeah, they 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 have been spying on you. I don't say spying, I'm gonna say watching you. This person has been watching you. And this is with um um I believe that's for sure Taurus and um I can't remember the other sign. Hold on. Virgo, I want to get it right because I don't want you coming back and saying, uh-uh. Aries. So we're talking about a Taurus or Aries. They have been, they have been um, watching you. Not so much spying on you. They're watching you. Well, I guess that's spying, huh? Yeah, this is this person is a new love for you. Taurus showed up again, but it's going to be a successful, a successful relationship. But they they want to work at it, and they and you want to work at it too, Virgo, because there's love here. Okay. Yeah, there's love there. The fool's card too. It's a new love too. Yeah, but they want you to make sure you 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 speak your truth, your communication. Um, someone wants to be pregnant. Someone want to have a baby. <clears throat> yeah. Either you want to have a baby, female, or male, you want them to have a baby. Yeah. But you also afraid. You're also afraid of this love. The spirit saying this love is going to heal the both of you. Oh my gosh. You got the Ten of Cups, the Nine of Cups, happiness. The Nine of Cups is also your wish come true. So either you wish for this Virgo or manifest it. They want to help you. They're going to help you heal because they love you. Mm -hmm. They love you. The Eight of Pentacles, please. They want that there. Okay. Eight of Pentacles. Okay, so your strength. Your strength is your home life. Your, your, your how you could take a home and make you could take a house and make it a home. That's what I'm hearing. That you have skills on making people feel at home, making them feel love. You know how to make your home a stable home. Yeah. Make it peaceful. See? Ten of Pentacles. Happy family. Happy family. But then there's another ten. So this is a new beginning. 
They want you to get out your head, Virgo, because you're, you, the Ten of um, Swords is saying that you are all up in your head. But this is a new beginning for both of you. This is a new love. They love you. You love them. Stay out of your head, Virgo. There's a lot of passion. A lot of passion. <gasps> Soulmates. You guys are soulmates. And if it's a Taurus, they're going to make you happy. So don't worry. So don't worry. But there is going to be changes. And that's what's going to make you disappointed. The changes. You even might, might voice it. That you don't want those changes. But then it's going to be an offer. And it's going to come fast. And it's going to be what you like, Virgo. Marriage. See? Wow, I like it when they do it like this. was so easy to read. <laughs> I like it when they do it like this. Yeah, it's going to be an offer of marriage. You're going to be so happy. They see you as a queen. Not only queen of pentacles, the, the queen of the earth. They see you as queen of passion. Sheesh, Virgo. What you do to that person? All this passion. But you still in your head, Virgo? What are you in your head about? They do want to marry you. They want to celebrate you. They want to celebrate you. They have so much passion. Virgo. You're making me bring out the, the big guns. <laughs> Look at all of this. Okay. They love you. They coming to you. They might be coming from overseas or they might be coming just over water they're coming from afar but they come into you they love you see i can't make this shit up if i tried they coming overseas over water even from land okay they come into you because they want you two to be together you see this so Virgo, get out your head. Now they also want you to go back to school. <laughs> they told Sagittarius that too. Virgo. 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 They saying Virgo, Virgo. Okay, if there's a Virgo, Virgo relationship, I think they want to talk to you. Wow. Oh my goodness. If there is a Virgo Virgo relationship, it's gonna last a lifetime. They love you, you love them. You both wanna work hard at it, and you guys gonna make money together. That's it, that's all for that. That's what they're saying. Now going back to this page of Pentacles, they do want you to go back to school. Yep, institution. They want you to go back to a college. They want you to get a degree on something you love to do. Now, if you're dealing with, again, it, it brought it up again. If you're dealing with a Taurus or a Aries, they're going to make you happy. They're going to stick by you. They're going to be there for you. They're going to be there when, when no one else is there. That's what I'm hearing. See, it's the opposite. They're going to be there for you. See, you've been out in the cold through with other, other re love relationships. And you're, you're, you're afraid that's going to happen. But he, he's saying, I'm... I'm I'm here for the long haul, not the short haul. Cause this is how he sees you. He sees you as a bad bitch. 
boss, a woman who has a lot of love to give, and she works with her intuition. See, he see you as, as the one, or she, or she. It could be the opposite. Okay, juggling this around. Oh, it's coming fast. It's coming, and it's coming fast. Marriage. <laughs> Again, it's in marriage. They live far, but they're planning to come. They want to take this leap of faith. It's things trying to stop them, but they're coming. Because this is how they see you. They see you as a queen. They, they have already given you three queens out of this. Look at this, and now look. You see how they see you? They see you as nurturing. They see you as a mother. They see you as love. You are love to them. They love you. You love them. And uh, I see nothing but happiness. If you're dealing with a Virgo, same thing. If you're dealing with a Taurus, same thing. Yeah. And they do want you to go back to school. They didn't. They said on something that you're passionate on, and they they're saying university. They're not saying just school. Okay, I'm 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 sorry. I'm looking back and see if I missed anything else because <clears throat> I want to make sure. But um, they want you to stay out your head because yeah, they even giving me a slight headache. They want you to stay out your head, Virgo. Stop worrying. This is going to be cool. Just go with the flow, Virgo. Go with the flow. Okay? I can't let you go before I ask you to like, share my video. And please don't forget to subscribe by clicking that button right there on the right. I truly appreciate it. I am Sin of the Moon Goddess.